when you are close enough to a target that your beacon believes it could be beneficial to mark, it will say mark across the bottom of the screen in the black banner. And at that time, you can hit the orange button on the screen, which is essentially telling your beacon that you no longer want to search for that one because you've found it. And it's going to then default to the next closest signal. Again, you can only mark when prompted to do so on the screen and it will determine the proper distance. If you ever get the prompt at a distance greater than three meters, then that indicates that the beacon through triangulation of the three different antennas has determined that you are likely dealing with a deep burial, which should be very rare. So again, normally you will not see the prompt until you are within three meters in find search mode but the beacon may give you that prompt in as, as far away as six meters, which should be a red flag for you that you're probably dealing with a deep burial. And now I'm gonna show you what that would look like on the screen. I have now completed the guided find search portion of the search. On the screen, it is giving me a prompt that it telling me it's time to probe and it is also across the bottom of the screen giving me the option to mark. So I'm now going to mark this victim that I have probed. You see that tells me I found victim number one and now is gone, defaulted into the guided find search portion for the next victim. During guided find search, the arrow is telling you which direction to go to and with this compass bearing icon it's also ensuring that you're moving in the proper directions on the fixed axes that you are supposed to move in.